I approve this message, Kamala Harris instantly uses Trump's own words against him. HuffPost That didn't take long. Below are your comments. A much greater emphasis, as Biden stated last night, will be placed on the relative difference in age between the two candidates. The ageist attacks on Biden by the Republican Party provide a wealth of material. Trump's tax cuts for the rich have really paid off. Since 2017 their net worth has more than doubled and now only 800 people hold more wealth than half of U.S. citizens and at the same time Trump added $8 trillion to U.S. debt. More than double any previous four years in U.S. history. That is called kleptocracy. Trump's shtick is only effective against candidates that are hated by the right and unpopular on the left as well. Like Hillary and Biden. That's why it's been so frustrating seeing him rise to power with almost zero good qualities. Mildly humorous insults is not a good quality for a president. We never had the right candidate to counteract him. I think the right candidate is here now. He can't hide behind mutual disdain for the Democrat from the left and right. Our candidate is now likable and is a stark contrast to what Trump offers, anger, hate, division. Trump blames everyone in an authority position for his crimes but not himself. Juries say different when he was found guilty on 34 counts. There are more juries coming for Trump. No one is above the law. Vote blue and then the Supreme Court justices can be impeached for siding with defendants like Trump simply because they are in same political party just like canon would the sc bend over backwards for a democrat defendant the sc should remain unbiased and comply with the existing law and not change it for any defendants to help them escape prosecution that is wrong they should be held accountable like trump should be Trump's tax cuts for the rich have really paid off. Since 2017 their net worth has more than doubled. And now only 800 people hold more wealth than half of U.S. citizens and at the same time Trump added $8 trillion to U.S. debt. More than double any previous four years in U.S. history. That is called kleptocracy. Please subscribe to my channel. And if you like it, please thumbs up.